Hi there. My name is John Holden. I graduated from the University of Connecticut in 1992 with a bachelor's degree in ornamental horticulture. In 1993, I started Land Designs Unlimited. I design, install, and maintain landscapes for homeowners in Upper Fairfield County, Connecticut. Today, I'd like to share my passion with you. Hi folks, today I'd like to go ahead and show you the end result of the pruning video I made for Hydrangea paniculata last December and I'll put a link to that right over here. And what I did is I pruned this hydrangea behind me all the way back to bare wood and then I came back in May and followed up and I'll put a link to that right here. I followed up and showed you what the new growth looks like when it came in. Well it's now early August and our Hydrangea paniculata is in full bloom. And look at how full the shrub is. And I guess that's kind of the point I want to make is don't be afraid to prune too much on your hydrangea paniculata because trust me, she likes to grow. Now we had a very rainy, uh, we had a dry start to the season, but we followed up the last three or four weeks with a very rainy summer. So I am gonna say that it's probably a little bit more growth than usual, but you can see the flowers are so heavy on the shrub that they kind of fell down. And what I did is I actually pruned some of the middle ones off. If you take a look here, we have some nice cut flowers too. But this is what your end result is gonna be for your hydrangea paniculata. And every year, you're just gonna go through and do the same thing, the same pruning again and again. So let me just step back here and show you to keep things in scale how large the shrub has gotten since we pruned it back. Now imagine had we not pruned this shrub, what a mess of growth this would have been. And you can really see why it's so important to go ahead and keep up with your pruning. For more landscaping tips and tricks, please visit my blog at landdesigns.com. Once again, I'm landscape designer John Holden here in Newtown, Connecticut. Thanks a lot for watching today, folks.